going on my YouTube? It's your girl Seiko LaRue. Coming to shower with another video. And today, I'm just going to keep it. Try to keep it short and sweet. Because let's just keep it all the way funky. I don't have time for, you know, a long ass video today. I have other shit to do. But anyway. Today, I was on a Bossip and a couple other websites. And I came across the posting about Little Debbie's new video. If y'all don't know who Little Debbie is, she's the uh, the quiet chick. Well, not necessarily quiet, quiet, but the quiet one in White Girl Mob. You know, the one that doesn't really say much. She's just about her music. So uh, she came out with a video for her song Ratchets. Now, here's my issue, not with Little Debbie. But with black people in general right now, why is it that every time somebody says something about the word ratchet and you see a, a couple black people in the video, you automatically assume that they're talking about the whole black community? Why? Because last time I checked, I'm not ratchet. I'm not out here doing reckless ratchet shit. Are you? All the ratchets aren't offended. The ratchets like the song. The ratchets like the video. Why do they like the video? Because it's a bunch of big booty black bitches with BB homemaker hair and Budweiser fucking bikini bathing suits. Popping, shaking, and dropping it like it's hot. Pretty much like we see in all other music videos. So why the fuck are you so upset with the, with the name of the song being Ratchets? Let me guess. It's because she's white, right? Let's get one thing straight. Had it been a black rapper to come out with a song like this, nobody would be upset. It's expected. Oh, he's a rapper. That's his job. That's what he's supposed to do. No. No. If you're going to be mad at one rapper for doing it, be mad at all the rappers for doing it. Like I said, you're mad at her because she's a white girl who embraces the ratchet lifestyle, who embraces the ratchet behavior. Now, here's the fucked up part about it. Philip and Emmanuel Hudson, salute to them niggas, came out with a song basically making fun of all ratchet bitches and niggas. The Ratchet Anthem and uh, their song Mr. Mr. And um, you laughed at it. Laughed your asses off. But Lil Debbie makes a song basically saying, hey, if she ratchet, she can fuck with me. You get mad. Why? Because white people like ratchet black people. Oh, wait, I'm sorry, because ratchet doesn't just apply to black people. Last time I checked, it applies to white people, too. Hmm. Honey Boo Boo. A dollar make me holler, honey, boo-boo, child. That bitch, ratchet as fuck. Mm-hmm. So it's clear that in this day and age, even back then, a ratchet doesn't just apply to one race. So why get mad about it? Why associate your skin tone with ratchet? Because you see some black bitches in a music video. You see black bitches in music videos all the time. Pussy popping for Pim. For a fucking ham sandwich and $20. So why are you so upset that you see black bitches popping and shaking in her music video? It's because she's white. Just keep it all the way 100. The minute that you keep it all the way 100 with yourself about this whole video situation, the happier your motherfucking be. Seriously. Because at the end of the day, that's what it all boils down to. It's a race thing. This has absolutely nothing to do with the fact that, oh, she, like, she, oh, oh, it's not cool. To, it's not cool to talk about ratchet people. Or, oh, all them, all them bitches in the video, they all look so fucking ratchet. No, you're mad because she's white. You're mad because she's embracing the ratchet lifestyle as opposed to, I don't know, being racist as fuck and talking about us behind our backs. You're mad about it. The last time I checked, my skin tone, I don't associate my shit with nothing negative. Because the last time I checked, I'm a high school graduate who plans on going back to college to get a degree. 
Last time I checked, my black is beautiful. Last time I checked, I'm well spoken in the sun, bitch, and I can walk into any any facility after an interview and walk out with a job. It's been proven. Not a problem. But if you associate your skin tone with being ratchet, that's a problem. And maybe, just maybe, you need to do some some soul searching. Maybe you need to find yourself. Because there is no way in hell that I'm going to associate myself with the bullshit that other people are doing. I'm different. I'm different for a reason. And if you can't figure out the fact that you're different, you're different for a reason, and you're different is beautiful, what the fuck is the purpose of you even being like here? What's the purpose? What's your point? Like, I'm not understanding it. I'm not understanding how someone can honestly sit here and look at a video about uh, a white girl chilling with ratchet ass, ratchet ass bitches, period. And assume, oh yeah, she's coming down on the black community. I'm sorry. Who the fuck is she coming down on? She's coming down on you because she's not coming down on me. I'm an individual. I don't give a fuck if I am black. I'm an individual. You're an individual. If you can't differentiate yourself from other bitches, seek fucking help. You might need to seek some mental help because, um, yeah, you might have some, um, some, uh, mental issues there. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking you're either a little slow or... Maybe you just have multiple personality disorders. Maybe you just think you this other motherfucker in your mind. Like, I don't know. But get that shit checked out. Anyway, people, new videos every fucking week. I know I be late. I know I be slacking. But it is what it is. Um, Everybody follow the Twitter. Hit me on Instagram, Reverberation, all of that shit. It'll be down here. So, holla at y'all later. Doses.